Hey guys, in this video, we're going to be talking about Ryobi's two 18 volt string trimmer, edger, and blower combo kits. Before we get started, make sure to hit that subscribe button. We release videos every Thursday. And if you guys have any Ryobi tool comparisons or review videos you would like to see, let us know in the comments. The cheaper kit comes with a 10 inch string trimmer, edger, and a 200 CFM blower. The more expensive kit, comes with an adjustable 13 to 15 inch string trimmer edger and a 280 CFM blower. The 200 CFM blower is very lightweight, only four and a half pounds, and it's simple in design and use. Simply put in your Ryobi battery, press the switch forward, and you're ready to remove any leaves from hard surfaces. Its lightweight design makes it easy for anyone to use comfortably. A 280 CFM blower from Ryobi weighs over 6 pounds. And although it's very similar design and use to the 200 CFM blower, it does have one additional feature that makes it nicer. You have a variable speed trigger. And while this blower has an incredible amount of power compared to the 200 CFM, it is quite a bit heavier, but the battery will last longer due to the nature of the motor in this one compared to the 200 CFM. The 10 inch string trimmer edger weighs just 4 pounds. It features an auto feed string head which allows the string to extend every time you release the trigger. You're also able to rotate the shaft 180 degrees. You have a front grip to be able to grip with your extra hand. You got a safety and then the trigger itself. Your battery compartment is underneath. Press your safety, squeeze your trigger. You're ready to go. The 13 to 15 inch adjustable string trimmer edger weighs seven and a half pounds, so almost twice the amount as the previous edger. It also features the ability to determine if you want a 13 inch cutting width or 15 inch cutting width based off of the string cutter right here. If you flip it around, you're able to go up to 15 inches. Right now, I've got mine set for 13. By depressing this, you can swap the head down to an edger cutting ability, which will allow the wheel to roll on the ground as you're edging on concrete. Pressing it back, and you go back to the weed whacker for function. You have an adjustable front handle. Simply undo the locking mechanism. And you can rotate the handle where you need it. You also have a high speed and a low speed function. Swapping back and forth with that switch right there. You have your safety and you have a variable speed trigger just like the 280 CFM blower. Put your battery into the end of it. Right now I've set it for low. Depress your safety. Release. Go for high. And that covers the 13 to 15 inch adjustable trimmer and edger. So if you're wondering why I have two different sets here that accomplish essentially the same thing, it's I bought the newer set for my mom. She's quite a bit smaller and she was complaining about having to use the heavier uh, weed whacker that I have and she wanted something lighter. So we went out and we bought the shorter set for her because this is nearly half the weight of my string trimmer. And uh, we only wanted the trimmer at the time, but we couldn't find it being sold separately. So we bought the box set, which came with the blower. Uh, I don't really need two blowers, but it's fine. Now we have an additional one as backup. Uh, overall, between the two, I do feel like this is the better set. There's a lot more features on these. They're more powerful. And the edging capability on this is more dedicated compared to the edger on this one, where you're really just trying to weed whack close to the concrete. But if you are smaller or um, you don't want to deal with hauling around a heavier piece of equipment, then this is definitely the set for you. But if you want those added features and more dedicated features that make these tools better at what they do, then I would buy this box set instead. Okay, so that completes our review of the two different box sets of string trimmers and blowers from Ryobi. Again, in conclusion, I prefer my original box set that I bought but if you do want that smaller one, they have that available for you. So if you like this video, then give us a thumbs up. And if you have any more questions or comments about these products, then just go ahead and leave them down below. And we'll see you next time on Grunt Cave.